My name is Eric Pina with MP Systems. Today we're going to be talking about grounding in a substation. We gotta make sure we ground what we're working on in case of any switching errors or induction coming in. I just finished up grounding our dead line. What I did first is I tested live, which that, line, that side of the bus is live. Came back, tested dead, make sure that our line where we're gonna be doing work is dead. Then went back, tested live, make sure that nothing happened to the tester in between those points. So this bus section that we're at, it's isolated now, but you can't consider it dead or isolated until you tested dead and then grounded dead. That's a wrap.